You want to see me? Oh, yeah, sit down. I heard a rumor that your favorite version of King Kong is the one from the 70s. Yes, I like it, but it's complicated, okay? You have to understand the movie as an object of 70s cinema. Super producer Dino De Laurentiis set out to make the ultimate blockbuster, ripping off parts of Jaws and The Towering Inferno, then piling on action, comedy, and romance. He even advertised Kong as the most exciting original motion picture event of all time. I wouldn't go that far, but I would sneak out of the office to field questions about this underappreciated gem infrequently asked questions about King Kong. Is the 1976 Kong CGI or stop motion? Actually, in most scenes, Kong is a guy in a monkey suit. The costume is worn by Oscar-winning makeup artist Rick Baker, who'd previously played a gorilla in The Thing with Two Heads. The film also uses a 40-foot-tall mechanical model covered in 400 pounds of horse hair, and when the movie opened, individual hairs were given away as a promotional item. Who wrote the screenplay? The script was written by Lorenzo Semple Jr., who created the 1960s Batman TV show. His screenplay has a lot of sly, ironic humor that critics didn't really get. Like when Jessica Lange asks Kong, what's your sign? You're supposed to be laughing with the movie, not at the movie. Does Kong die in the end? The film's ending would have you believe that Kong dies after falling off the Twin Towers, but we later learn he was only in a coma. That's how they justify King Kong Lives, a 1986 sequel where Kong meets a giant female ape and they make a baby. Are there any other sequels? Officially, no, but there was a British ripoff called Queen Kong about a female ape who falls in love with a man named Ray Fay. It was never theatrically released in America, but you can watch the trailer online. Did Hitler like the remake? Excellent question. History books tell us that Hitler's favorite movie was 1933's King Kong, but he never saw the remake because he died in 1945. Or did he? My shooter, everything is as you ordered. Okay, we've got time for one more question. Make it count. Are there any fun facts about the movie? Uh, no. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next week.